Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Rania Gunia here. So today I'm showing you how I make one of my favorite vegetable soup. So the vegetables I'm using today, they are my personal choice. Of course, you can use whatever you have at hand. It still work out. Okay, you need to also to decide which ones to use. Not all vegetables can be used to make soup. But whatever you have, kale, spinach, broccoli, cauliflower. If you have them, yeah, well and good, use them. For me, these are my favorites. I use them at all times. Of course, as you know, I am a mother. It also helps me with my milk supply for the baby, of course. Yeah, so let me take you through the ingredients and let's get started. So for the ingredients, I have potatoes. As you can see, I've chopped them. So this will help them to cook faster. And of course, it helps with thickening the soup. I have an onion for flavor, garlic and ginger. They are both to give that nice aroma in the soup. And of course, my vegetables, I've decided to use uh, French beans, carrot, and some peas. So I have some salt here, some Maggi cubes. I choose Maggi cubes, but you can also use any vegetable cube that you have. Roiko will also work perfectly. And I have water here that you're going to use to boil up our soup. So I'm going to put, to start with the vegetables, I'm going to put everything in the sufuria. So. I'll start by grating some ginger. That's enough. So I'll also add it in the sufuria. Then I'll grate the garlic. I'll also add it in the sphere with the vegetables. And then I'm going to fine chop my onion. Not really, I'm just going to cut it. But you can fine chop it if you want to. It is up to you. Just do some rough cuts like that. We are going to add it in the sephoria as well. Potatoes, I'm also going to cut it into nice thin cubes. So you cut as if you're cutting fries and then from there you can now make those nice cubes okay the size doesn't matter but just make sure they are small yeah the smaller they are the easier they're going to make your life them in this free and then I'm going to throw in the my cubes so for the cubes I'm only using two and remember if you're using the cubes they normally have salt so as you add in extra seasoning just add in a little so as you don't over season your Food. So I'll just also add in a pinch of salt. That's enough. If it's less, I'll correct it when the soup is ready. And then from here, I'll just add some water. Normally, put this together quickly and 
get them to boil for a few minutes this will probably take 20 to 15 minutes for it to get the, to get ready sorry for it to get ready and then i'll blend half of it and then half of it i'm going to leave it like that to have those chunks as i take the soup and of course it also helps with my milk supply and if you drink alcohol it's also good when you're hungover you can put in some meat if you have them at hand if you don't just do it like that and take it maybe the next day you're going to feel better trust me like just make sure when you're taking it if you're hungover make sure it is very very hot and then you know you take it fast and you feel better so i'm going to pop this on the cooker and then i'm going to show you how to be looking when it's ready So guys as you can see my soup is ready my vegetables are not overcooked as you can see the peas the french beans the carrots they have the original kind them i'll just take half of or half of this mix here and put it in my blender I like my vegetable soup. I want something. I I want to have something to chew as I drink my soup. So I'm going to serve like that. If you have some bread at hand, it will still work perfectly. So guys, the soup is done. As you can see, I love the color. All the flavors balance well. It's so sweet, I like it. Hope you're going to try this recipe. It's really, really good. And I hope you liked or you enjoy spending time with me. And if you did, please like this video, comment, share, and subscribe to my channel. I'll see you next time. Bye.